Hey everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to the Rideshare Hub. My name is Dylan. Thank you so much for coming by. So in today's video, I'm talking about uh, how Lyft might have just scammed this driver. So we're going to talk about him. This driver for Lyft actually claims that he got scammed by Lyft. So if you like these topics, make sure to give the video a big thumbs up. If you drive for Uber or for Lyft, or if you ever have given at least one single ride, uh, or if you've taken one ride as a passenger, give the video a big thumbs up. I would appreciate that. If you like money, thumbs up the video. If you like watching these videos, thumbs up the video. Thank you so much. It really helps me out and supports me so, so much. All right, now let's get started with today's video. And subscribe. Click that subscribe button as well. This is Facebook. And in today's video, we're talking, we're going over in my uh, Facebook group. It's called Uber slash Lyft Drivers Facebook group group. This is a hoot and a holler of a group, guys. So today we're looking at a driver by the name of Candido Aviles. Candido Aviles. He goes, Lyft be scamming. Guys, do you see that? Lyft be sca scamming, scamming by giving drop off time, wrong drop off time frame. Let's look at this. And comment down below if you've ever had something fishy like this come up too. He goes, a request came in this morning and Lyft mentioned the drop off time it, this, by the way, is absolutely crazy, guys. You don't want to miss this. 45 minutes. So I said to myself, I'll drive 45 minutes to drop off a passer. So I took the request. Bruh. Oh my gosh, my camera be playing tricks on me today. Wow, okay, sorry. Sorry, Candido, I dropped you. Sorry guys, watching this, I accidentally dropped you. He goes, so I took up, I took the passenger request and I drove to the destination to pick up the passenger, which was at a hotel. So when the passenger got in my car, I slide the pick up passenger, and all of a sudden, the time wasn't 45 minutes, it changed to one hour, 55 minute drop off. It was drop off at a New York airport. I don't do New York trips and Lyft comes and pulls a scam saying it was a 45 minute drop off trip. Also, it took more than one hour, 55 minutes to get there. Beware if you get anything like this. Lyft tend to trick drivers. And he only got 127 bucks for 117 miles. I mean, he still did get over a dollar a mile, which is good, but obviously he does have to drive home. And that's, that's a bit of a long drive. So... 24 reactions on this post guys by the way if you want to get some clout post something like this in my group and you will go viral this guy went viral 24 uh reactions he goes mofo they always pull sh like this so donnie's been scammed too susan goes not a scam it will show 45 plus which means it will it may be 45 minutes or it may be longer you will not oh so was it a 45 plus i didn't see the plus symbol it was small that i didn't see it it's better if they just Oh, maybe it was a 45 plus because I do put 45 plus. Maybe he wasn't looking correctly. Mm. Let's see what anybody else says. Got me too. But on the other end, trip would say 45 minutes. When I pick them up, it'll be 20 minutes. Shoot, that much in two hours? That's awesome. Kayla is happy for him. Oh, part of this is tolls probably on 20 bucks. It's 15 for the GWB of Razano. Both ways. Not sure I would call it a scam when they give you the opportunity to make more money <laughs> than you could have for the ride. I would take $120 rides any day. They should have put a destination name instead of 45 plus. So according to all these people, it did say 45 plus and Candido just didn't see the plus sign. Yeah, there it is guys. That's the 45 plus. Guys, Lyft be playing tricks. They make that plus sign is that do they make all the words in bold except for the plus sign do they make the plus sign smaller on purpose so people don't see that i i think it did say 45 plus i don't know this guy claims that they scammed him but like in this one five minute trip north east 17 minutes away i hope he's using get upside i hope he's at least using get upside so he gets money on that cash back on his gas fill ups if he's not then that is a lot of waste of money on the gas anyways guys that's it for today's video. I just want to share this with you. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more videos. All right, talk to y'all soon. Later, guys. Peace.